So we've been having some problems with the square connecting to networks and I am here to troubleshoot it forward. There you go. You doing pretty good, how you doing today? We've been having some problems with our square syncing to the internet. We have a phone for when we use it outside and we have two different hotspot connections that we can use or Wi-Fi points that we can use inside. The first Wi-Fi point for inside is the MPL library. It is the public library that is located inside of the building. The second is the fun zone connection, which is part of the scooter connection for the interior part of the fun zone, the train. So this is what we've been having a problem with, sync error. And you can hit try again or configuration settings. And I hit configuration settings. Now, if we were outside, we would be looking for the train. Inside, we can go Liberty Center Public or we can go, uh, for now, we're gonna leave it off because I would like to find the library. Now we're here where we normally park the train. And the first thing I'm gonna look for is the library. But if you look, we don't need the library anymore because Fun Zone shows up right there at the bottom. Actually, Fun Zone now has moved, but we have MPL Public at the top. I don't know if you can see that. MPL Public is at the top right there. I don't know if we need MPL Public or Private. Let's hit. So we need a password for Public. We don't want that. Okay. Go back in the network. We have MB MPL, which is the public library, and it says public right there, hit it, and we're connecting to the library. And now we're connected, so all transactions would go through. MPL works properly. Now we're gonna go downstairs and we're gonna look for the fun zone to show up when we get downstairs. Hey. Now we have the fun zone showing up and we are down here at the fun zone. We can hit fun zone. It automatically connected to fun zone once I walked inside. For the scooters, you have the public library to connect inside MPL and you have fun zone. At this point, you would hit configure settings and we will go through that and I will do configure settings with each device. The first device is gonna be the Liberty Center Fun Zone. So now we're at the Liberty Center Fun Zone. At this point, we would hit Configure Settings. Now when you configure settings, you see how it automatically connected to the Fun Zone. And now we have it set up and you can go out and start payments. All right, so now we have another error syncing, which means we were too far away from an internet connection. And that means we have no service yet again. Now we're gonna go upstairs and connect to the library. All right, so we're back up at the library. And this is where we would normally park the train, right here. So when you're at this point, this is when we would hit the setting button, configure settings. It's still connected to the fun zone. We wanna look for MPL public but we're still strong enough to be connected to the fun zone because the fun zone is literally right over there. So we can either use fun zone or MPL, but let's just hit the public library. And if, at that point, it has now switched to the public library, but the fun zone also works and that is one that we pay for so we could use it. So we're back at the train. And now that we're back at the train, we still have the same thing showing on the screen. And now we have to get out the, let's go look at it in the shade. Now we're gonna have to get out the cell phone and use the cell phone to reestablish the connection. So when you come into this part, you're going to turn on your phone, unlock your phone, go into hotspot settings, which we're gonna go ahead and back out of this just to show you how it's done. 
you go into personal hotspot, then you wanna make sure everything is on. I turn it, I like to toggle things off and then turn, toggle them back on. You wanna wait until you get a green bar up here, but how we're gonna do that is by going into the square terminal, hit setup configuration. Now, when you look at the top, you have a train Wi-Fi, and that's the one you wanna connect to. It just went away, it's right there now. You click a train, oh, wrong one. A train Wi-Fi. That's not the one I wanted. I wanted A train. A train. All right. Now it's connected to A train Wi-Fi at the top. If you look, you can see A train Wi-Fi. And then over here, you will see those green bars at the top. You must have those green bars, and you must have A train uh, Wi-Fi at the top. So if you had a different Wi-Fi network and you wanted to be able to use your phone with your Square away from other hot spots we're out in the outside and we needed somewhere to use it that is how you set your phone up or other networks up to utilize the square on the go and if you cannot do that you can always take purchases credit card purchases offline and then when you get to a place where you have a wi-fi or a hot spot you can sync the transactions then I would like to show what it does if you don't have internet. Um, let's go do offline. Let's turn off my hotspot. So now the green bars are gone from the top. And if we go into network, A train should go away. And it did. It went away. Now we have no um, Wi-Fi. Uh, it went to Liberty Center automatically. It just picked up Liter Liberty Center public automatically out here so you don't have to have it set up to the wi-fi because it picked that one up on its own let's turn that one off or disconnect from it it says forget this network i don't want to forget this network no let's forget it so now we have no network established we're gonna go in and we're gonna say try again try again it didn't work, so now we'll hit configure, configure settings. It doesn't have any Wi-Fi at the top currently, but I can still make purchases. And as soon as I come in contact with the Wi-Fi setting again, it will automatically take care of those transactions for you. It will sync them and send them through so you can see them. But basically, that is how you set up a Wi-Fi connection. I could go back in and choose this one, wait, wrong one. It doesn't require a password. So we'll go here, Liberty Center Public. And it's connected now to Liberty Center Public. So that is how we do it. And that should be simple enough. If I wanna come back in here, I will just come back in to settings. I would toggle on and toggle on and then wait for it to show up over here, which I would back out and then hit network. And then when you come in, you see how it made it pop up right there and you can click a train Wi-Fi. It will move a train Wi-Fi up here to the top, which you see is connecting to it. Now it is now connected to a train Wi-Fi. And there you have it. The green bars are at the top showing that it is sending out a signal to the square device. I hope that was helpful. I hope that answered any questions. I get a lot of questions about how to set up a square to Internet and how to use it. Um, when it's offline, I feel like I just showed multiple ways of connecting it and how easy it is to connect no matter where you move to. Anyway, thank y'all for watching and tuning in. I hope this was helpful to someone. Much respect, much love, and we out.